Good morning stampers and crafters, it's Maria here with you today and I am back to share with you a process video of this card and I'm actually using a couple of new stamp sets by Newton Snook Design and before I show you the process videos I'm going to be showing you the new stamps and dies for the August release and then I'm going to go ahead and show you a process video of this simple card so if you guys would like to see the new August release then please keep watching so here are the stamps and dies from the August release the first one that you see here is called Believe in Unicorns and it features three unicorn images, really, really cute. As well as cute sentiments, a rainbow here with the clouds, stars, some stardusts, heart, and you can also purchase the coordinating dies. The second stamp set is called Once Upon a Princess and really cute stamp set features this princess kissing a frog or holding a frog and then this one facing here with her eyes closed really cute images with the castle, the greenery, the frog prince this is always believe in your dreams, happy birthday princess sending smooches happily ever after if the crown fits and it also comes with the coordinating dies if you would like to purchase them the third stamp set is called Knight's Quest and it features the two knights here really cute images the knight over there holding the shield and then this one with the shield and riding a horse a small dragon really cute image and a banner here that you can make this fit always be brave my hero on your birthday the whole kingdom belongs to you and you can also purchase the coordinating dies and then the last one is called autumn newton and it features three images of newton one is with all the falling leaves and then the corn stalk i think with the pumpkins and then this one with the little basket here with a bunch of fall harvest stuff. And it says harvest blessings, fall breeze, autumn leaves. Hope your autumn is a pile of fun. And then you can also purchase the coordinating dies. So this is the card that we're making today. And I'm going to be showing you a process video. So stick around and watch the process. So I have my new stamping platform here by Tim Holtz and this is my new favorite at the moment because it is very sturdy and I think it's really worth the money and I'm showing you here that you can stamp the images one time and it's already clear but if you want a crisp image then you have to stamp it twice. And I'm just showing you that I will be stamping more images which is the unicorn and the princess and I'm going to use the coordinating dies first to die cut those images and then I'm going to do some simple Copic coloring I'm not going to be able to show you my Copic coloring this time and it's going to be a while before I can get back to the normal swing of things because I still have to take long breaks in between when I'm coloring because of my herniated disc so I apologize if there's no Copic coloring in this video but here's when I Copic colored all of the images already and then I'm just showing you here a die from my stash that I have die cut to create the little windows here with the die cut and then I am going to use my distress oxide inks with some inexpensive brush and I am showing you here that I'm just using a makeup brush this is the elf brush that you can find from any store like Walmart or Target and this is pretty inexpensive and in order for you to create those subtle background this is the perfect way to add color to your cardstock and I'm just using here those inexpensive brushes to add some color and then I'm going to use my distress sprayer to spritz some water on the cardstock and then dab it with the paper towel
here is where I use another die from my stash and I am going to stamp the sentiment on this die cut and I will be using the on your birthday the whole kingdom belongs to you sentiment I'm just using my stamping platform here again to stamp the sentiment perfectly on this die cut and as I said this card is very simple as you can see so I'm just going to leave you guys alone now and stop talking so you can enjoy the rest of the process video. So here are the three stamp sets again that I have used for today's video. It's the Magical Unicorns, Once Upon a Princess, and Night's Quest. Here's the card that I made today with you. If you guys liked the video today, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. And I hope you check out Newton Snook August release. And I will see you on my next crafting project. Bye for now and have an amazing day.